Hello everyone, welcome to Spiritual Butterfly. Today I will be doing a reading for the sign of Capricorn. So Capricorn, this is a love reading. So these messages could be for people who are single, in relationships, or separated. Whatever spirit wants to put forth, that is what I will speak. Remember that this is a general reading, so not everything is going to resonate. Just take what does, apply it, leave the rest. Also Capricorn, Remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click that notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. So let's jump right into it and look at some of your love energies. So Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn? Messages for Capricorn. What messages do you have for Capricorn? Okay. Oh, I have the seven of wands. Let's get some more messages. <laughs> I have the five of swords in the reverse. Let's get one more. And I have the five of wands. So Capricorn, like we have a lot of like hostile energies here, but this seven of wands, like it's what's standing out to me the most. I'm getting two messages with the seven of wands. I feel like your guard is going to be up when it comes to someone. Um, I heard like returning. So this is going to be someone from your past who's trying to return. Um, I'm also getting new for some of you. This is a new relationship that is getting ready to come in. And I heard like fight for you. It's like I'm getting Prince song. Um, you. I think it's called I Will Die For You. Um, Purple Rain soundtrack. But instead of die, it's like I will fight for you. So this new person, they are going to be willing to fight for you. To fight for this relationship. I feel like with this five of swords, like this is you Capricorn. I just feel like you're very laid back. Um, just kind of, you know, take life easy, you know, take things as they come. But like this person is very different. For some of you um, with this wand, this person may be a fire sign, um, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries, but it's like opposites where you're more laid back. Like this person is not like rah-rah, like they're ready for it. So I heard like defend. I feel like this person will defend your honor, Capricorn. So let's pull some more messages to go a little bit deeper. Spirit, tell me more about the Seven of Wands. Again, I'm just getting like this person will fight for you. They will fight for this relationship. two of cups yeah this person will fight for this relationship will fight for this connection will fight to be with you i heard like against all odds by tupac yeah um this is somebody who i heard like still in love this is someone who you are going to be able to build a very long-term connection with i heard commitment um i heard like life partner yeah this is someone you're going to be able to spend the rest of your life with. I feel like this is somebody who's like really going to want to take care of you. Um, who's just going to be very protective and guarded of you, of your energy, um, of your time. Yeah, again, I just heard protector. Like this person is a protector. Let's get a message for the five of swords in the reverse. Okay, what do I have here? Yeah, I have the Hierophant in the reverse. So I'm getting two messages with this Hierophant. The first message is like, for some of you, not that you've given up on love or on relationships or marriage, but I just feel like it's not something that you're really concerned about at this time. It's like, if it comes, it comes. 
Um, I'm not worried about it. Um, I'm not trying to rush into anything. I'm not going out looking for it. I'm going to let it come to me. It's almost like this person is like willing to fight to win your heart. Um, they're willing to fight to prove themselves to you. I heard like to prove that like you're the one. You're the one for them. Um, I'm also getting like with this five of swords and the hierophant. Um, I'm getting like release, let go. I feel like for some of you, you've already let go of a past relationship. Um, for some of you, this could be a marriage that didn't work out. I feel like hostility is like you're no longer hostile. There's no grudges. Um, when it comes to this person, you've healed. You've healed from what didn't work out. Spirit, give me a message for the five of wands in the upright. Okay, what do we have? Look at what I have. The Seven of Cups and the Three of Swords. Um, I heard I will never leave. Yeah. So, this person is like willing to defend your honor. Um, I will never leave. Like, they... They don't want to hurt you. Like, they will never hurt you. Um, again, this person is going to prove themselves. That they're not like the rest. They're not like this person from your past. Um, for some of you, you're getting, like, a lot of attention. A lot of people are being drawn to you. And so, I feel like this person feels like they have to do something to stand out. Like, they have to do something to get your attention. Because you have so many people, like, vying for you. Um, I heard like ask you out. Yeah, you have a lot of suitors for some of you. You have a lot of people who are interested. So I feel like this person feel like they have to go above and beyond to get you to notice them. That's what I'm getting. Let's pull some more love energy for you. Spirit, give me some more love energy for Capricorn. Again, I heard like you're the one. Like this person really feels like you're the one. You're it. Um, they really like the fact that you're very grounded. I'm just looking at what she has on. Um, for some of you, like, um, you may be like very connected to to Earth. Um, you are an Earth sign, Capricorn. But it's like there's just something about you. Um, what is the word I'm looking for? Like the girl next door. Yeah. You remind them of the girl next door. I have extroverted. This person is very fiery. Like, this is this person. They're very fiery. Like, they don't hold back. Like, they say what's on their mind. Where you may be, like, more reserved. Spirit, give me some more messages. I feel like for some of you, like, this person may own their own company or they may have a very um, prestigious position at a company. I heard, like, higher position than you. I have attraction. Capricorn, like, this person thinks, like, you're so beautiful, so handsome, so attractive. Um, I heard dress like they love the way you dress. I heard like hair. There's something about your hair. They love your hair. I heard curls. So, you, so for some of you, you may wear a lot of curls in your hair. Or your hair may be curly, but they love it. Let's get another message. I'm also getting like scarves. For someone like you like to wear like a lot of scarves. I heard like plaid scarves. Um, scarves like with a lot of lines on it. I'm getting like. Uh, like a blue and white scarf like with blue lines on it it's like yeah they love the way like you dress i heard like modest like you're just very modest i heard like just well put together and then i have forgiveness so capricorn i feel like again in the beginning like i said and this is separate from 
these messages. I feel like with this forgiveness, like there's going to be someone who wants to, I heard like apology, who wants to give you an apology, who wants to like amend a situation with you. Um, for some of you, again, I'm getting like ex-spouse. So this was like an ex-husband, ex-wife. They want to amend things with you. This is somebody you have like a children or a child with. Yeah, I heard like, please forgive me. For some of you, I heard like, come home. Like this person may want to come home. You may be in separation from this person. But it's like, there's someone that wants to amend a situation. That wants to resolve an issue when it comes to this relationship. Let's get some more messages to go a little bit deeper. Spirit, tell me about extroverted So I have the Eight of Swords and I have the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay, so for some of you, like this person wasn't born into money. They were not born into money. So whatever they have attained, they worked hard for it. This person has worked hard for it. I feel like with this Eight of Swords, like they're very motivated. Um, this person doesn't get stuck in their head a lot. Um, they're very action oriented. Yeah, like they're a go-getter. So yeah, anything that they have financially, like they were not born with a silver spoon in their mouth. They worked for everything that they have. Let's get a message for attraction. I have the hanging one in the reverse, the knight of pentacles, and the three of cups. So when I'm getting like this person, um, they have definitely been thinking about like what it would be like to um, be physical with you, Capricorn. This person is very experimental. Like they like to try new things. Like I heard like boring, like this person is not boring. This is not someone who's boring um, when it comes to the physical part of the relationship, the intimacy. Um, this person definitely likes to try new things. Let's clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Uh, this person doesn't just um, sleep with anyone with this Knight of Pentacles. This person just, just doesn't sleep with anyone. Um, they're very selective about who they give themselves to who they give their body to yeah i have the page of cups yeah there has to be an element of attraction like there has to be some type of emotional connection for this person to become intimate with anyone um yeah it's not just them you know seeking a thrill wanting to have a good time like there has to be something there spirit give me a message for forgiveness Look at what I have. The sun in the reverse and judgment. Yeah, this is somebody from your past. Like, it just, it didn't work out. You were not happy with this person. Uh, you love this person, but in the end, they just really couldn't give you what you wanted when it came to a relationship. Um, for some of you, I heard karma with this judgment. This is part of this person's karma. Like, seeing you move on with someone else. You know, seeing someone else give you what they were not willing to give you that's just, that is part of their karma watching you be happy with someone else let's pull some final messages for you spirit give me some final messages for capricorn yeah because they really did not want to give you the love that you deserve like they really shortchanged you in this relationship like with this son in the reverse like they knew exactly what to do like they just did enough to keep you but never really went above and beyond um they were not consistent when it came to this connection it was a very up and down type of seesaw energy you were never fully happy they always let you down That we have here we have the star in the reverse 
We have the Two of Swords. We have the Seven of Cups. Okay, so this is talking about this past person. So they did not recognize your worth. They did not see the value in you. That's why they entertain other people. It's like... I'm getting like down low, living a double life. It's like this person lived two lives where, you know, they were in a serious relationship. They were married. And then, you know, at night, they will be with other people. They will be entertaining other men, other women. It's like this person just lived a double life where they put on a show in front of other people. Um, they were an upstanding person, a family man or family woman. And then at night, you know, they were going out to the clubs, giving their numbers out. Um, not coming home until the early hours of the morning is like, yeah, this person lived two lives and they really did not see your value, your worth at the time. Let's clarify the star. Yeah, the five of cups. But you moved on and you know that this person did not appreciate you, that you were being shortchanged in this relationship, but you've healed, like you moved on from the situation. I feel like you don't even really think about this person at all. Spirit, tell me about the two of swords. Yeah, you've outgrown the situation. You have moved on. You're not even upset anymore. With the Two of Swords, I have the Six of Pentacles. I have the World in the Reverse. And I have the Queen of Wands. So, for some of you, this person may have had, like, another child. And it's like, they have to give. They have to take care of this child. They have to give to the mother of this child. Um, They may be, like, on child support. But it's like, they're not happy. They're not happy with the decisions that they made. Yeah, because I feel like this Queen of Wands, like... This is somebody who doesn't play. Like, she wants her money. She wants it now. Like, <laughs> no, she doesn't play. And so they have to give. Even when they don't want to. Even when they don't have. They have to come up with the money. They have to come up with the means to get whatever she wants for this child. Like, she uses the child against them. And they're in deep regret about their decision. Spirit, tell me about the Seven of Cups. Yeah, she does not play. I'm just looking at this black cat. It's like, no. And I heard court. She will take them to court if she has to. I'm also getting like custody with this Two of Swords. They may have to split custody. But again, going back to this Five of Cups, like, you you realize you're better off without this person. And you're glad because it's like avoiding a disaster. That's what you did. You avoided a disaster. Spirit, give me a message for the Seven of Cups. The Three of Wands. I feel like with this three of wands, like this person is like struggling to move on. Um, They're also struggling to find someone, like to find the right person. Again, they feel like they missed an opportunity. Yeah, they're having a huge challenge in the love department. Yeah, again, I heard karma. Like, yeah, everything that they're experiencing is a part of their karma. So Capricorn, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone, stay blessed.